can't just leave. We have to help them. We don't even know who we are or who they are. And I don't want to help out a couple of strangers. You may not remember who you are, but at least you know this about yourself. You're a selfish being and a total coward. Me? A coward? I am not a coward. I... I'm a free spirit, so don't come if you don't want to. But I'm out of here. <sighs> Did he go to get help? I don't think we should hold our breath. <gasps> Ladybug, Cat Noir, we, we know, know you're, you're in here. here. You won't get away this time. You, you remember, remember your BFF, BFF Oblivio, don't you? Don't, don't tell us you've you forgotten God. us. <laughs> 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 I'm not convinced that this monster is really our best friend. One thing's for sure. If we're superheroes, he can't find out about our secret identities. How about some kind of diversion? We get out of here and take the emergency stairs. Sorry, I need this. I'll call you, and when he comes, we make a run for it. I'll use the tape to pull your phone back. Ready? No wonder I fell in love with you. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, gotcha. You shouldn't, you shouldn't have, have forgotten, forgotten to switch off your phone. You're trying to fool Oblivio again, but it's not going to work this time. Or perhaps we give you too much credit. <laughs> you saved our lives. Thank you. Let's head back to where we were. It's the last place he'll think of looking for us. A coward and me? Whatever. Huh? Huh? Adrian? I may not remember my own name, but I know for a fact that I'm brave. <laughs> I am. <laughs> this is called psychological harassment. <laughs> Sorry, your phone's out of juice. No worries. We're doing pretty well, even without powers, don't you think? It's true. You two make a very effective couple. Yes, but if we want a real shot at defeating this villain, we're going to have to become Ladybug and Cat Noir again. Maybe we can gather hints by watching some news footage to see what happened before he erased our memories. Hey! Do something! What do you want me to do? I don't know! You're the cop! I am? Uh, Nadia, you're on the air. Me? What do I do? Uh, uh, don't be bemused, it's just the news. Since early this afternoon, a supervillain by the name of Oblivio has been erasing the memories of everyone he comes across. Ladybug and Cat Noir are tracking him down inside Montparnasse Tower. Well, right now, he's the one tracking us down. Ladybug and Cat Noir are toying with you, Oblivio. If you can't manage to find them, then, then we'll, we'll flush them out, out of hiding, Hawk Moth. are struggling today. And stop calling us a couple! We don't exactly look lovey-dovey in this footage. Probably just a regular fight like all couples have. The battle against Oblivio continues. <gasps> oh, oh no! Cat Noir has been hit, but Ladybug pulls him out of danger. <gasps> What's she doing now? Ladybug is down too! The drawing! There was a drawing on the elevator wall! I remember now! It was a turtle! I saw it earlier when I was looking for my mom's number. There it is! You left yourself a message. So smart. Mm. Hello? Uh, Mr. Turtle? Marinette, is there a problem? Listen, I can't remember who I am or who you are. Oblivio has erased my memory, but I think I'm supposed to call you. You did the right thing. Is Cat Noir with you? Yeah, well, uh, Adrian, actually. Uh, you do know your true identities, uh, then? We're not supposed to? That's okay. The miraculous ladybugs will repair everything mm -hmm. anyway. We figured out we're superheroes, but we don't know how to make ourselves Ladybug and Cat Noir again. <gasps> Mr. Turtle! You'll have to tell us quick. I'm almost out of battery. Are your Kwamis with you? Uh, if you mean the flying creatures, then one of them, the red one, is with us. Okay, listen carefully. 
carefully. The Red Kwame's name is Tiki. She gives you your powers. Say, Tiki spots on, and you'll transform into Ladybug. You'll find an emergency user's guide in your bug phone. Adrian, your Kwame's the black one. His name is Plug. Tell him, Plug, claws out, and you'll become Cat Noir again. The rest is in your cat phone. But my Kwame took off. You won't be able to transform without him. either. But maybe this Adrian boy has some yummy camembert left. Plag, you promised me you wouldn't go back there. Sorry, Sugar Q, but I can't resist such irresistible beauty. Here it sits every day beckoning me with its gooey lusciousness, and every time I eat it, it just pops right back up the very next day. Don't you think it's strange that this gross, stinky thing just reappears in the same spot day after day? That's precisely why I call it the magic cheese. Ah, I've got you at last, strange creatures. This is exactly why you should always listen to me. Let's get out of here. Oh, oh. And they speak too. I can't. It's impossible to abandon such a creamy, cozy robe in the show. Hey, what's going on? Stay focused on Moliere and his plays. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Oh, go ahead and run away. I have proof of my great scientific discovery. You don't want me reading your little secrets, Marinette? I don't have any secrets from you, Tiki. You're the only one I can discuss my double life with. Even my parents or Alia don't know me as well as you do. I'm so happy to have you, Tiki. You're the only being I can really be myself with without ever having to lie. I'm really happy to have you, too. Good night, Tiki. Good night, Marinette. Black, we must tell our owners or Master Fu the truth about what happened today. Chill out, Sugar Cube. Don't forget that nobody can capture or record us. I know that, but we were actually seen by a human and at school, too. That could jeopardize our owner's secret identities. Uh, okay, I promise you I won't eat any more magic cheese ever again. And really, what's the worst that could happen anyway? Mr. Damocles, can you confirm rumors that Mrs. Mendeleev isn't here today because she'll be appearing on the Alternative Truth TV show? Where everything isn't always true, but nothing's really false. It is indeed quite possible that Mrs. Mendeleev has made a scientific discovery of utmost importance. Can we watch the show, please? Huh? Oh, my brother's one of the guests, too. And we're back for the next segment of Alternative Truth, where everything, where everything isn't, isn't always, always true, true, but, but nothing is really false. false. Let's welcome our last guest today, Miss Mendeleev, a science teacher at Francois Dupont High School. Yay, that's our teacher! Kim, uh, sit down, please. Hello, thank you for having me. You're going to describe an innovative scientific theory to our panel of experts who will then decide if it's true or false. True or false! Set. So, Miss Mendeleev, you already know our jury. Its members are, as always, the famous singer XY and the one and only Mr. Banana. Stay peachy! And the incredible Manon Shamak, daughter of our favorite news reporter, Nadia Shamak. Over to you, Miss Mendeleev. What you are about to witness is proof of the existence of interdimensional creatures with incredible powers who can move through matter and seem to be attracted to aged cheese. I discovered the first of these creatures soon after school began in September. I started observing it closely. Then I discovered a second one. I have proof. Watch closely. You can't see the creatures themselves because they're not filmable. But look right there. <laughs> Given that I was unable to capture these creatures on video, I've made sketches of them to give you an idea of what they look like. What's that even supposed to be? I seriously doubt this show is remotely scientific whatsoever. Mrs. Mendeleev, are you serious about actually chasing cheese-eating ghosts? I'm always serious. I thought we didn't keep secrets from one another. I didn't want to bother you with Kwame nonsense. Besides, I thought the problem had been resolved. I promised you wouldn't eat any of that magic cheese anymore. Wait a sec. If Plag was there too, that means that he was here in this school, which means Cat Noir is a student at Francois Dupont just like me. And if I just figured this out, then that means that Cat Noir probably just figured out that I figured out that he figured it out. Uh, no, not at all. You know, Plag would travel for miles just to sink his teeth into good cheese. <laughs> 
You see, the problem now is that I'm always going to wonder whether you're lying or not. Uh, I'm so sorry, Marinette. It's okay. I know you're trying to protect me. If I figure out who he is, I'll have to give up my Miraculous and Ladybug. So I won't try, and I hope he doesn't either. There's something you don't see every day. Kwame Buster, I promised you Kwame's, and here they are. Now bring me all the miraculous in return. You can't get away from me. You're no match for Kwame Buster. Catch us if you can. Psst. Cat Noir, is that you? Ladybug? Just when I think I finally know you, you managed to surprise me again. That's very sweet of you, but I'm not Ladybug. I'm Multi Mouse. Ladybug has sent me to fetch a Miraculous to defeat Kwame Buster. How do I know I can trust you? Ladybug trusted me when she gave me a Miraculous, didn't she? Tell her I'm relying on her to bring Plague back. Okay, thank you. Oh yeah, Ladybug said you should meet her on the roof. It looks like your owner has failed us, Tiki. We're doomed. Ladybug? I told you that my owner was the best! I've never abandoned you, Tiki. <laughs> Flag! Molo? Unify! Tiki? Molo? Mysterious multi mouse. Thank you. See you, Cat Noir. <laughs> Mirage! I think you better find a way to convince everyone that you're not a student at Francois Dupont High School. You're right, that would be safer. Plaque, walk out! Being Cat Noir is much more appealing than being a banana. Good job, Multi Mouse. Thanks to you, I got my Kwame back and Cat Noir's. Awesome plan, girls! Right? No, not here! Marinette, you shouldn't have given me the Miraculous back, not in front of... But I didn't think you kept any secrets from each other. Oh, I am so clumsy. I'm sorry, but now your identity is no longer a secret. I won't be able to give you a Miraculous again. I'll take Marinette back, Cat Noir. You take care of Ms. Mendeleev. Ladybug, wait! I wanted to apologize for my Kwame. I don't know what he was doing in that elementary school. It was a high school. High school, right! I promise it'll never happen again. Bug out! <laughs> Mr. Cat, would you be willing to testify so that people will know I really did make a scientific discovery? I'm sorry, Mrs. Mendeleev, but I can't do that. And you have to help us keep it a secret if you want us to protect Paris from Hawk Mom. Uh, I understand. I guess I'm just like Copernicus, way ahead of my time. Uh, yeah, that's right. Just like him. Huh? Oh, oh, oh. All his Kwamis. So many powers. If I can capture them first, I will form my own army of miraculous wearing supervillains and defeat Ladybug and Cat Noir once and for all. I must find the Guardian. No more 
more evil doing for you, little Akuma. Bye-bye, little butterfly. Miraculous! 